Hey everyone, it's Chris at Lion Punch Forge. Today we're going to go over the Lion's Claw Gold, Gold Edition, and talk about some of the tips and customizations and ways that you can use it. I'm not going to do a whole lot of talking. I'm just going to start bending some metal, sticking it in the end, showing you what it can hold, putting it to some music, and that way you don't get to listen to me talk and chat and all that kind of stuff. So. There will be other videos where you get to listen to me yammer on about all sorts of fun stuff and try and make myself laugh because that's what it is. I make jokes not for everybody but for me to make myself laugh. It's good times. So without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and do that right over here on the desk. However, before I do, check out limepunchforge.com metalsmithmafia.com lpfswag.com and that'll all be right down here in the thing. You'll, you'll see it. You'll see it. And then uh, if you haven't already, there's a red subscribe button down there and a bell. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you want to be notified. Hit that bell and you'll know when I make a new video. So I really, really appreciate you guys. Thank you for watching. Thanks for the support and all the tools and all that kind of stuff. And if you haven't already, Check out the Haymaker saw. It's shipping now. A saw frame, so light and balanced, it feels like a part of you. <sighs> and it comes in colors. Red, blue, gold, black. Some amazing stuff. So appreciate you guys and enjoy the different uses for the Lion's Claw Gold. And in conjunction with the original lion's claw so let's do it all right we're going to go over some different tip options for the lion's claw gold before we do that i'm going to explain what makes the gold different from the original so the original is made from all aluminum and it has a titanium tip pressed into it. So here you have your aluminum and your titanium tip, which you can bend as a foot. Now there's enough titanium in there to heat up and bend and he heat up and bend that you're going to get a long life out of this. The gold. The shaft is made from brass and you still have your weights, but the tip has a cullet and it accepts interchangeable, customizable or replaceable tips. So for example, I have a, just a steel rod here. I'm going to insert that into the cullet and tighten it down. And now I have a straight point, just like I would with the original. So what sets this apart is obviously the different materials, but the ability to change that out. So if that tip gets worn out or I need a different option to hold something down, I can insert another tip. Say this one's already pre-bent for me. And tighten that down. Now I have a pre made foot all set up in order to hold something down. So, say a flat tip or a foot isn't quite what you're looking for, doesn't quite do the job, I can remove that and I can insert and make a heart shape tip. So I'm gonna make that real quick on camera. I'm, for this demonstration, I do include titanium wire with the gold kits, but I'm gonna use stainless wire for this because I really don't want to use up all of my titanium wire for dem demos. Demons. All right, so first thing I'm gonna do is take my wire and then bend it right in the middle. I'm going to try and get these two flat. 
So I'll take some pliers flat against each other. So, and I've now started that to make kind of a loop. So these are pressed together so that they'll go into the cullet. And then it's easier for me if I stick it in uh, and then tighten it down. So now that I have that loop, I'm going to flatten it, pair of pliers, and I'm going to take each side and try and bend it down to create a part. Now you don't necessarily need to do this in the tool, it's just easier for me to hold it and do that while I'm talking on camera. So now that I have just a rough shaped heart here, I can readjust it so that it's flat on both sides and I can use that to solder on unusual shapes. Let's see, this is a little bit too big. If I wanted to solder that one, I need to make a little bit bigger heart. So this one, I now have my heart in place, balancing it where I need to.